May 18 and it's International Museum Day. So, because of that, <laughs> we're going to a museum. <laughs> so, do you know about that day? Yeah, there is such a thing as International Museum Day. I just found out because I saw it on the Facebook page of Intramuros Administration. <laughs> all right, all right. Anyway, so since today is a special day, uh, some of the museums in Intramuros actually have free entrance. So that's where Martin and I are going. Yes, I'm excited because uh, I think I've been there. I can't recall 100%, but we'll see. But I'm, I'm excited about museums. It's the influence of Den, basically. So yes. I'm starting to love history because I used to fail them back in grade school and high school. Yeah, and I'm the complete opposite because I love history. <laughs> Actually, in UP, I studied broadcast communication, pero nag electives ako ng mga history kasi sobrang hilig ko sa history so I was like the only random broadcom student there tapos kasama ko mga history majors <laughs> <laughs> so out of place yung parang feeling nila ang gagawa mo dito it's <laughs> a broadcom doing it yeah uh, for so, me yeah. I'm a math like I love math so much and I'm business management and um my org is dancing. <laughs> also way off. First stop is we're going to Casa Manila because that's what I'm most excited about. So I'll tell you more about it when we get there. Kasi, tsaka sayang kasi na free entrance kasi let's say we're visiting kung are five museums. Tapos tigo, kung tigo 100 each na lang dun, ha, At least nakatipid kami ng 500 each na entrance fee. True that, true that. Anything free is great. Yes. <laughs> So there. So we're just gonna brave this Manila traffic, and we'll see you there in Intramuros. Yes. We're about to enter the walled city, aka Intramuros. <laughs> now my watch is over. There. No to the wall. No to the wall. <laughs> Because Indra means inside and Muros means wall, so it literally means inside the walls. <laughs> Do they have Night's Watch in there? The Night's Watch. These are the gates of King's Landing. Actually, yung ibang buildings dito sa Indra Muros, niya talaga sila luma. They were just like this one. They were just designed to look old, to go with the theme, pero bago na sila. Like 7 Eleven. Oh. 7 Eleven of the 1800s. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so, guys, ito na siya, yung Casa Manila. Pero magpa park mo na tayo. Here. Ay, may parking pa kaya. Ayan siya. Dito sa church wala na. Ayun, si kuya. Nagpapa park ba siya? Mahirap yung parking dito kasi nga maraming tao so merong isang kuya na ayan tumatakbo siya ililid niya kami to a parking slot. Ayan. Buti na lang maliit yung dala namin kotse. We're now here in Intramuros. So nagpark lang kami dito sa may uh, side streets tapos may bayad na 50 pesos for the guard daw. Tapos tip dun sa kuya na tumatak mo kanina. Magwardya si Pete. Magwardya si Pete. Yan. So, ito na yung San Agustin Church. This is actually the oldest church in the Philippines built in 1571. And right beside it, yun na yung Casa Manila. There. Mga bikes to eh. Doon pa tayo. Siguro. Doon pa. There. Oh nga. But I don't know how to ride a bike. Meron ding bike rental na made of bamboo. Pero hindi ako marunong mag-bike so hindi kami pwede mag -rent. Unfortunately, bawal mag-video sa loob. 
Unless what? Ah, unless it's for educational purposes. Eh, I upload ko, so baka bawal. So, dito na lang tayo sa labas, pwede. Ito siya from the outside. Tapos yun na yung exit. Diyan kami galing. And then, meron pala mas. Meron ding parang garden dito. Kaso may event. Kaya, yun. May mga tables. Kaya hindi masyado maganda picture. Ano? Uh -huh. It's steep. Yeah, it's quite steep. Yeah, and there's a restaurant around the area. Yeah. There's also the Barbaras. I know it's a restaurant here because the theme is the look of the Makaluma. Bili mo na kami nitong Spring Valley Juice kasi it's so hot. Sobrang inin. We're drinking apple juice. And orange juice. Here at Barbara. Ano siya? Spring Valley. Sobrang sarap. Alaman sa init. Ito yung restaurant mismo. Yan, makaluma din siya. Let's go. Ay, ang kulong. Makalumang cash register. Photo gusto mo? Ay lang. So now we're going inside San Agustin Church. See, it's so beautiful. So we can't make it because there's a wedding. But it's in San Agustin Church. There's a museum, but there's a 200 entrance fee. We're outside San Agustin Church. Kasi so may wedding so hindi kami makapasok sa loob. Eh ayun naman namin magbayad ng 200 pesos na museum entrance fee kasi nga it's International Museum Day. So do kami sa mga libre. So, Bumili na kami ng drink. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> mas masarap, masarap na. Hindi ko, hindi ko makuhaw. And you can you can go along with the other free museums. Mm -hmm. Sobrang inen. Tapos anyway, yung Casa Manila, it's really cool. Bawal kasi mag-video sa loob. Pero it was built in the 1980s para ipakita kung paano ba yung buhay ng mga mayayaman nung 1800s. So, parang siyang nakaset up na parang bahay talaga. Tapos lahat ng gamit sa loob, puro mga antiques, puro mga luma talaga from the 1800s. And then, um, yung feeling mo pagpasok mo sa loob, para kang nakitira. Uh, with them. Mm -hmm. Yung feeling mo you're back in the days tapos mga barkada mo lang sila or kapamilya mo sila parang nandun yung feeling na as if you were there. Yan yeah. na. Ganun yeah. feeling. So, sobrang overwhelming kasi everything is so grand tapos sobrang intricate ng mga design. As in every corner may design every space may design. So yun. Really cool. And it also smells nice. Yung amoy, amoy luma, amoy probinsya, parang masarap yung amoy talaga. Yeah, lahat made of nara, molabi, mga hardwood talaga. So yun, so entrance fee normally is 75 pesos. So if you're here, go check it out. It's definitely worth your 75 pesos. So 
ngayon, papunta na kami sa Bahay Chino, which is a museum showing the history of the Chinese here in the Philippines. So from Casa Manila, just go straight, tapos left down, and then right, tapos nandun na siya. This is... Yan yung dinaanan nila. Tama ba? Hindi, parang... What is this? A trade route. So this is a trade route from China. Tapos nakarating ng Philippines. Then back to China. So ito pala, you'll see na nagpa-barter trade sila. So ito yung Filipinos. This is the Chinese. Porcelain. Ito ruler, oh. Ruler. Chinese na nag ng shoes. Chinese goldsmith. Chinese vendors. So, itong mga statue, they based it on actual photos. Textile merchant and barber. What is that? Is that Shomai? <laughs> Wonton. Wonton! The yung favorite ko. A Chinese food vendor. <laughs> food peddler. So, meron na siyang portable stool. Ayan. Tapos may shopao, tofu, wonton, tsaka lumpia. Mm. Love it. Tapos may mga bowls na. Mm. I love it! Guys, si Jose Rizal pala may Chinese blood. You'll see the family tree. Chinese, Chinese. Going down to his father. That's yung sa mother side din niya. Spanish, Chinese. Going to the mother. Boom. Jose Rizal. Calling card on Rizal in Hong Kong. So, nakita kami ng friend ko from Miriam and Steph. <laughs> because of the ano, free museum entrance. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the Illustrado. So, itong atay bed, meron din ganyan kanina sa Casa Manila. And it was made by uh, Binondo Chinese, Eduardo Atay. Ayan. Four poster bed siya. Uh, ayan. Para na rin kayo nakapasok sa Casa Manila. <laughs> because of this, this place. Na-excite talaga ako pagpagkain. Ayun no, meron you naman. Shopao. <laughs> Tapos may lumpia. May tokwa pansit. Actually, fake yan. <laughs> So then, kung gusto mo talagang kumain, pwede man tayo kumain ng Chinese restaurant mamaya. Uh, just tell me. It's so refreshing kasi na may tanong food sa museum. Buti na lang aircon dito kasi sobrang init kanina sa labas. These are old pictures of Binondo. people were on the streets. So this is a photo of the old Binondo Church in Manila. Ang ganda. Sabi kasi ni Martin, bakit daw sobrang crisp nung picture and linaw 
Since small Chinese, that's Huawei for you guys. <laughs> Super <laughs> lino. Grabbing technology. Iba, iba class. Merong shirt dito na Chinese translation ng mi ultimo adios niyo sa Rizal. 250. Ang cool. Kamay na kami ng bed ka. Ha? Sige sabi ka? Ha? To go to. Masaya din siya po. Kasi medyo malayo. Hmm. And it's 30 pesos per person. I said it will be sir. Oh, that's a good idea. Oh, 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 I don't know what I'm doing. 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 Ano pangalan mo kuya? Ha? Jason Aino, sir. Ano pangalan mo kuya? Jason Aino to. Ha? Jason Aino. Jason Aino. Ayan. Jason Aino. was worthwhile. Yes. Um mag marami kaming ako oh, marami akong natutunan. Mm -hmm. I don't know about then she knows it every she knows everything. <laughs> so, but it was so fun seeing all the artifacts yes. and that things. And it really takes you back. Mm -hmm. And um ako like I, I was like amazed how these uh, things right in front of me are you know 300 400 years old or more. So nakakatuwa siya talaga. Yeah, so if you're free, come with your friends, with your family, visit all the museums here at Intramuros. It's fun and, and educational at the same time. Yes. Now, we're gonna go back to Barbaras to eat. Hi guys. Change of plans. Hindi na kami tumulay sa Barbaras kasi sobrang init. Parang nasusuka na ako sa init. <laughs> like literally, parang yung feeling na ganun na nasusuka na ako sa init at sa pagod. So we need aircon. <laughs> so, I need aircon. So, nandito na kami sa car. Tapos, pupunta na lang kami sa Robinson's Place, Manila. Tapos, doon na lang kami kakain. Because we are so tired. 
so, and hot and hungry. And hot and hungry. So tips: bring extra shirt kung magtutor kay dito sa Intramuros kasi sobrang init. And bring water. Mm -hmm. Grab you sobrang pois na pois na ako. By the way, if you go to Intramuros sa mga museums, namimigay sila ng free map. So this is a map of Intramuros, a map of Fort Santiago, Casa Manila, tsaka Baluarte de San Diego. So sobrang cool kasi first ang cool ng design nag revamp ang Intramuros. Pang millennial na yung design niya. <laughs> and ayan, meron ng map para mas madali yung mapuntahan yung mga tourist spots, tsaka may mga description na rin kung ano-ano ba yung mga yun. So, make sure to get a map pag nag-tour kayo sa Intramuros. We're alive again. May nag-change outfit na. Crispy, baby. Pinili niya yan kanina. Tapos ngayon, suot na niya. So, now we're here at Robinson's Place Manila to eat. Chicharron, dark chocolate. Meron yung queso de bola. So, dito na lang kami sa Early Bird Breakfast Club. Yung menu nila dito, kung wari Jario. <laughs> Kasi nga, breakfast. So, kung wari nagbabasa ka ng newspaper in the morning. Pero, tomato soup for Martin. So me. Lalo ba na? Lalo ba? Water milk chicken. Tomato cream. Ooh, that looks good. Tomato cream. Penne. And buttermilk chicken. And lakan ng serving. Flaky yung crust. So crispy. Tapos super juicy ng chicken. Tender. Kay Martin daw super cheesy. See? Cheesy. 